This is a CBS 4 News update. Good morning, I'm Carly Barnett. Two people are dead after a shooting at a gas station in southwest Miami-Dade. Police say also say they have one person in custody. This happened overnight at a gas station on Bird Road at 117th Avenue. No word yet on what led up to this shooting. And the Broward Sheriff and Public Defender are at odds over who's to blame for an inmate punching an assistant public defender. 27-year-old William Green punched Julie Chase yesterday morning in bond court. The Public Defender's Office says the inmate should never have been taken to jail since he was being held under the Baker Act. The assistant public defender is doing all right and will take a few days off of work. Now Green faces additional battery charges. And two men accused of leading Miami Beach police on a chase that led to a deadly crash are in jail this morning. Timothy Bowers and Richard Wallace both appeared in court yesterday. Investigators say a police cruiser crashed into a woman's car and two other cruisers Monday night while chasing these men. Police say they were in a stolen BMW. That woman, 68-year-old Yvonne Reyes, died at the hospital. Both suspects face several charges this morning. And a guilty plea this morning for a man caught with an arsenal of weapons in his truck in Miami Beach. 32-year-old James Goldammer of South Dakota was arrested back in October. Police officers found him sleeping behind the wheel of his truck on Ocean Court. Inside the vehicle, they found handguns, a rifle, ammunition, body armor, and other items. He now faces up to 10 years in federal prison. Now, CBS4 weather. Gusty wind again today, and we're starting to see that bring in a few showers. The spots of green here on the computer forecast showing a few passing showers. Once things heat up just a bit, a gusty breeze off the coast will work its way inland here. And the area of low pressure and high pressure responsible for that still in place today, but slowly moving out, so it'll take that gusty wind with it. Going from the reds to the yellow to the blues here, indicating the wind gets a little calmer. Friday morning, but by Saturday and Sunday, things are a little much calmer than what we have today. Still have that gale warning uh, in effect uh, with wind gusts 30, 40 miles an hour, maybe higher at times, especially off the coast. Small craft advisory all the way around the southern tip of the Florida Peninsula and the Keys and up the Gulf Coast. Uh, the gale warning becomes a small craft advisory later today, so still problems on the water tomorrow. Otherwise, 25, 30 knot winds, 8 to 16 foot seas. Rough in the bay, surf temperature 76. Uh, we will look at temperatures today and tomorrow climbing into the upper 70s and then we get much warmer here over the weekend as highs climb into the 80s over the weekend Saturday and Sunday with a calmer breeze. Thank you Dave. That's the news for now. You can always find us on CBSMiami.com and tune into CBS4 News at 5, 6, 7 and 11 for all of today's important headlines.